Our Nature Book, written by Anthony Dino, illustrated by Juliana Kolesova. Pictures help remind us of the people that we love, people here on earth with us and heaven up above. Throughout the years, Our Lady has been shown in many ways, in paintings, statues, books and cards, holiday displays. These images can help us pray and make us faithful too. From Our Lady's picture book, here are just a few. When Jesus was a tiny tot, Our Lady got him dressed. She took him to the temple so the baby could be blessed. Then Mary turned and saw a man, faithful, wise, and old. He told her she would suffer and the sword would pierce her soul. And sure enough, the man was right, and what he said came true. Mary's life was very hard and full of sorrows, too. So when you're feeling sad and blue and gloomy now and then, ask Our Lady for her help to make you smile again. When Jesus was a little boy, he had a scary dream. He saw a cross and spear and nails and woke up with a scream. His mother took him in her arms and hugged and squeezed him tight. She kissed his head and held his hands, and soon he felt all right. So when you're scared and filled with fear and don't know what to do, ask Our Lady for her help. She will comfort you. When Mary lived in Nazareth, her house was made of stone. Our Lady stayed there many years until her son was grown. This house in which the family lived together happily was flown by angels in the sky and brought to Italy. So when your family needs some prayers and is doing well, ask Our Lady for her help to bless the place you dwell. When Mary's mission was complete and all her work was done, her soul and body God took up to be beside her son. From heaven she can help us more with constant loving prayer sending graces down to us and people everywhere. So when your body's feeling weak and sluggish, sick and sore, ask Our Lady for her help to make you strong and pure. When ships at sea are caught in storms and black clouds fill the night, Our Lady leads them to the shore just like a guiding light. She's often called the Northern Star because she points the way to safety in the arms of Jesus when we go astray. So when you're lost and in distress and feeling all alone, ask Our Lady for her help and she will lead you home. When Christian people on the earth throughout their history were persecuted for their faith, they prayed the rosary. And when these Christians had to fight in battles on the sea, Our Lady helped them with her prayers and gave them victory. So when you're feeling overwhelmed and trying not to sin, ask Our Lady for her help to struggle till you win. When children misbehave by being bad and telling lies, God forgives them always if they just apologize. The Lord is kind and merciful to children big and small. He helps them get back up again the moment that they fall. So when you've sinned by doing something God does not allow, ask Our Lady for her help to say you're sorry now. When all the world is plagued by wars and hatred fills the air, Mary prays to God for peace and friendship everywhere. The only way the gift of peace can ever be restored 
is if we worship Mary's Son, Jesus Christ the Lord. So when you're feeling really mad at people that you know, ask Our Lady for her help to let your anger go. Our Lady's heart belongs to God. It's spotless, clean, and pure. That's why it's called immaculate for now and evermore. Her heart in heaven beats with love for boys and girls like you. She's mother to our Lord above, but she's your mother too. So ask Our Lady for her help. Ask her day and night. Ask her when you're feeling sad. Ask with all your might. Ask Our Lady, never fear. Ask for anything. She will bring you peace and joy from Jesus Christ the King.